Hello everyone, and welcome back to Minecraft 1.21. Uh, well, first of all, the sun is setting. Let me go to bed real quick. Yeah, quick. Sleepy time. Need sleep. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. So in the last episode, I explored the desert and ended up settling here, kind of building a sort of a starter house. Not really complete, but yeah. The next thing I think I'd like to do is honestly just focus on the house a bit more, kind of remodel it and actually make it into something decent. So let's do that. For this, I'm going to need a lot more sandstone, I think. Uh, let me collect everything that I have. Now, what if I did something like I'm kind of envisioning a couple of like wings off to the side. So like this would be one room, one uh, wing, and then we'd have one over here. And then I don't know. What if we had like stairs going up to it maybe or something? I don't know. Maybe I should extend this part out a little bit and then, um, yeah, that'll kind of be more almost like a cat. Well, not a castle, but like a small fortress kind of thing. I hope it looks good. We're going to we're going to experiment a bit. Let's convert these into that cut sandstone. I'll definitely have to mine some more shortly. Actually, yeah, let's go and get some more sandstone before I start. For oh. Hello, Mr. Skelamans. Oh. All right, that's probably uh, a good sign or not a good sign, but a sign that I have to light this all up. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, that wasn't good. Certainly a wake-up call. God, there's another one down there. What's going on? I bet I sounded like Courage the Cowardly Dog when I stuttered like that. That was great. Okay, <laughs> this should be sufficiently lit. I sincerely hope so. All right, we've got five stacks of sandstone. I'm gonna smelt some of this so it's smooth, and then the others, I might... Well, I might leave like one or two of them raw, and then the others I'll just have either cut or, um, you know, smooth. Say, uh, one of these gets smelted. Oh yeah, by the way, I realized I accidentally cut out when I was editing the other episode, well, the first episode, um, I found that lava lake over there where I built the nether portal from, and then I got a second cauldron, uh, to, you know, expand my lava farm, so... I had to fill you guys in a little bit. <laughs> you know what, I guess in the expansion of my house, I don't have a silk touch, uh, pickaxe yet, but I would like to make one so I can, like, you know, not waste all this glass. Not that I'll use it for the design that I kind of have in mind, but it'd be nice to have, right? Then again, there is sand all over the place, and I can always make more glass, but I'm kind of cheap like that, so, yeah. I guess while that's smelting, I'll start laying out the foundation, well, the sun's setting. Um, I kind of want the stairs maybe to start here. i do two or three. I'll do three. Let's make these into stairs. Uh, let's see. I'm your favorite reference, baby. Look, look, look at my stairs. We're gonna need some more sandstone. But first, I think I'm gonna try to get some more iron. Alright, here's the gold. Oh, I found a cave, y'all. Oh my god, it's huge. Oh, here comes a guy. Also, look at all this dripstone. That's marvelous. There's a hole up there. Oh. Ah. No, don't. Ah, oh, so much iron here. And you know what? I have just enough to make an anvil. So let me go make that. And then put this fortune on my uh, pickaxe. And then we can get going from there. Alright, inside. Uh-oh. Eh, don't hurt me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh god. I don't wanna. I don't want any. 
Okay, let's make a quick... Ow. There we go. So I need 31 ingots, which I have 5, and then plus 27, so that's just enough. Um, let's quickly smelt the rest of this sandstone, because I don't want guys like him getting inside my house. Um, let's see, there he is. Ha! Ow. There we go. Nice. Alright. And there it is. Uh, let's just put it in the corner over here. Alright, fortune one. I don't want to completely use up this pickaxe yet, so I'm going to go back down, find some more iron, and then use that for various things like more pickaxes. And probably some coal too, because I'm starting to run low on torches. Oh, how'd I miss this? Oh yeah, although it's only fortune one, of course. So I probably won't get that much iron until a bit later. I have only a small likelihood of getting duplicates of iron and stuff. God, this place looks so hostile. Uh-oh. I really wish I could find, like, a big ore vein for iron. Because that would be super useful. Um, oh, here we go. Oh, do I have any sticks on me? I hope I do. Oh, good. Okay. Um, let's make some torches. Oh. Here we go. Oh, nice. Hey, a whole iron ingot. Well, thank you. Hey, there's like diamond ore over here. Neat. Oh, but just one. If I get one more, I can actually make an enchanting table, which would be lovely. What's going on with the this block here? Oh, there we go. It was just a lighting glitch. Alright, there's a pit of lava. Probably not much for me down here. Still give it a little look-see. Hey, yeah, I'm not gonna risk anything. <gasps> Is that a mineshaft? Alright, I'll have to check that out in a second. Oh! Well, look at there. That's beautiful. So none of them... Wait, maybe they did duplicate a little bit. This is a big mine shaft, up, as far as I can tell. Oh god, that was loud. It startled me a bit. Oh my gosh, more diamonds. Oh, hello cave spider. Ouch. Oh, two he is. And a, a creeper, also. Oh, hey, minecart. Alright, neat. I don't think there's anything in here for me, but... There is a lot of dripstone. I could make a dripstone farm, even if I have an ample amount. Screw it, let's get them. All right, that is just enough. Let's continue onward. Oh, hey. Hey, friend. Hey, diamonds. Oh, hello. I can't mine with a torch. You silly goose. Oh, neat. Oh, there we go. Neat. <laughs> oh, it's 26. I could actually make full diamond armor already, if I wanted to. It's a big vein right here. Oh my god, stop! <laughs> oh, we capped off at a whole stack of iron. Okay. Yeah, definitely time to leave. Um, if I can find the way out. Give me a few minutes. Oh, 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 uh-oh, uh-oh. Not today, hell spawn. I didn't make this, did I? What the hell is going on here? This is a weird glitch. What is- oh. Okay, I thought there was like some sort of like natural gas in the distance. I guess that's just my render distance. And it looks like it's either dawn or dusk. So, it looks like it's dusk actually. It's not good. 
Please don't hurt me. <laughs> it's fine. I wasn't included in that. Oh. <laughs> okay. That could have been even worse than it started out to be. Get me out of here. Is this it? Oh. Hallelujah. What a freaking maze. Get me out of this hell hole. This hole of hell. <laughs> Daylight. Oh, finally. Can I? No, I can't. Okay. Let's get the fire started. The fire. Oh, hey, this... <laughs> That's right. I'll have to continue doing the sandstone after I get all this. And then I'll put my current diamond pickaxe to rest. For a little while. But first, let's get our enchanting table started. Alright, here's our little lava hole. There you go. Just kind of section it off piece by piece. Alright, we got our four pieces of obsidian. Let's return to our base. I need to make some paper. I haven't any. Um, where's the sugar cane? I can make three pieces of paper. And then the rest I can plant. First, let's craft a book. Oh wait, is it two books? I might need two books. Or is it- no, it's two diamonds. Yeah, let's get those diamond ba uh, back out. Alright, uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, one. And it's a cool. Brilliant. I got me an enchanting table. Hmm. It's not really a great spot for it anywhere yet. I kind of actually want to turn this room into the enchantery. The enchanting room. So I will do that at a later point. And move the rest of my stuff like on the upper level. Or an up, uh, upper level. And just so it's convenient for me. I should probably um, go ahead and plant the sugar cane someplace. Like, I'll start a small farm. I'm not going to have it here permanently, but this is a good start. So while that farm's starting, I'm just going to go and harvest some more from in the wild. And then just use those for whatever. Let's craft one more book because I want to see if I can enchant anything yet. Oh, and lapis. There we go. Um, Aquafinity... Mm, nothing great at the moment. What if I try to enchant another pickaxe with something? Is it possible to plant any of these glowberries inside? <gasps> Neat! I should have, like, some flowing water in here or something, and then maybe have the enchanting table in the middle. Wouldn't that look cool? I can see it now. It's almost done. All this golden iron. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what comes out of this. Hmm, I'm breaking an efficiency. If we try and breaking. And then what's on the book? Density. Oh, is that for the mace? I think that's for the mace. I could do efficiency, but I also like having fortune. Hmm. I could try to enchant another iron pick. Oh wait, I need more iron first. Let's grab from here the whole stack. Um, there's the gold. I have a whole stack of that now. So if I try to craft another iron pickaxe, or two even, it's all efficiency. How about the book? Projectile sharpness. Neither is helpful, and I don't have enough levels, it seems. Yeah, I'll have to figure this out later. Um, so what if I can convert all this into paper? Um, I kind of want to- oh, there we go. I kind of want to see what the villagers will trade. I don't even know if either of these ones close by have a librarian or not. You know what, first things first, let's just finish um, the roof of this and maybe put a couple torches on top so nothing spawns at night. Right, let's try to combine these actually. Um, two or one. Let's put the third thing of Globor- Globor is- Oh my god, it's already growing so long. Um, let's put the third one over here. Right, is this the spot? 
He might be kind of off, but who cares? Well, actually, one, two, three. No, we're good. Um, let's get some of this. Make it in a bone meal. Ugh. Yes, delicious. All right, now we got a bunch of glow berries. So not only do I have extra lighting, but these provide the... Hello? <laughs> I very... <gasps> There's an enderman right there. Uh, I need to go kill him or something. Uh oh. Oh god. He evades my he evades my attacks. He's smart. Ow. Ow. Oh my god. Um, river. Oh no! This is a mistake. A very big mistake. Oh god. Stop it. <laughs> Jump in! No. Oh. God, you're freaky. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Don't heal! Heal! Damn it! Oh! Just die! Okay. That could have been very, very much worse. <laughs> well, now that that's happened, <laughs> let me just grab some more fuel. Um, while I'm here... Oh wait, how do I do it again? There we go. I can also make a fishing rod. Neat. Alright, um, let's go back down and just grab some more sandstone for further construction. Oh, where is the torches? There we go. Yeah, let's continue digging out this space so I can build my whatever it's gonna be. That should be enough. Let's just kind of, you know, keep this more permanent or something. Here we go. Okay, um, let's smelt some more sandstone. Dang, no lava. I wonder... Well, first of all, I wonder how stupid of an idea this is about to be. I'm gonna see if I can harvest a little bit from the nether. And then, I'll have to expand my lava farm just a little bit more. So, let's see. Hi, don't mind me. God, it's laggy. Okay. Running. Going back. In and out. Just like that. Don't hurt me. Okay, good. There we go. Alright, and then to craft a couple more cauldrons and grab a couple pieces of dripstone. And then seven pieces... One, two. Neat. Okay, so a couple of problems that I'm gonna run into in trying to make this little enchantery. Uh, one, I don't have any access to leather out here. So perhaps I'll have to travel to a village where cows will spawn and then bring them back here for me to have multiply and then shear, well not shear, but kill them for leather. So. Um, that's one thing. Also, I guess while I'm out and about, I kind of want to see if I can trade for, you know, a mending book, which I know is going to be a very difficult reroll to get. Um, but yeah, that's probably the only option I have if I want to have a really good pickaxe. So, I mean, if I don't successfully get something, uh, like relatively soon, then it's whatever. But I would rather have a mending villager than not. So. After I go to sleep, I'm going to try to see if, um, you know, I can do that. Also, I should really organize my chest at some point because they're already getting both very full and I'd like to have some proper storage, or a proper storage space, rather. So that's on the agenda, too. Alright. Alright, let's try my luck with these guys over here first. I don't even really know which building is supposed to be the librarian. We're gonna find out. Hey, there's some beets, actually. Uh, let me just save some of those. Again, I like to have some crop diversity. Even if beets aren't really the most beneficial crop to have. Hey, what's that? I really want to know whether that's pumpkin or melon. Okay, who are you? Oh, you're, um... What, what, what are you called? Oh, a mason. Okay. 
Uh, who is this? It's just a house. Um, another house. 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 Oh, Lord. Over here looks like another tower. This is a living space. There's this house. Which has this guy still stuck. Can I push him out? You've been stuck here for God knows... Oh. I, I somehow made it worse. Oh, there he goes. Oh no, he fell in. Don't worry. I'll save you from this weirdness that's going on. Ah, uh, that didn't help. He's trying to get out. <laughs> this is just the funniest thing I've seen so far. I hope I don't suffocate him. Ow. You're free. Go live life, or whatever. Well, this last house over here, yeah, it just looks like houses. In fact, I don't even remember seeing a librarian on any of my travels. So that's kind of a problem. Well, what if I go ahead... Oh, oh wait, actually... I have a problem. I haven't seen any cattle, and I need to make books if I want to make a book. Or, like, a, a, a lectern. Well, let me go to the next village. Also, I just realized I didn't even bring any crafting table with me. That'd be wise. Even though they have their own crafting tables in their villages, I should still bring something. Onward! I wonder if, like, like what kind of passive mobs um, spawn over in these river areas? Because maybe, just maybe, there would be cows and pigs and stuff. Then again, that is probably a stupid assumption of me. This looks like a cartographer house. Yes, that's a cartographer. But no librarian. That's the blacksmith that I got my diamonds and stuff from. Um, yeah. Oh, that was a camel. I was scared that was, like, something else. I don't know. Hello, everyone. None of you particularly looks like a... Oh, that's a cartographer. Um, yeah, none of you has a book on your head, so I don't think there's any librarians here. Unless... No, that's a leather worker. And then, yeah, I... This is... Frustrating. Yeah. We might have to go back to the plains that I saw last episode, because... There ain't nothing out here. That kind of sucks. Alright, well, let me run back home. Oh, hello! I can get leather from this guy. Stop. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I'll probably take a red tulip. Here we go. Thank you, invisible man. Um, actually, I should probably kill him. Hello? Uh oh. This isn't good. <laughs> Help. I don't see him anywhere. Oh, where's your particles? He's really invisible when he wants to be. God, I keep missing him. And he's not even really moving. Hello? I'm swinging. Dude. Here we go. I don't even care if I'm critting him. This has got to be the dumbest fight I found myself in. It's not even a fight. I'm just assaulting the guy. <laughs> Dang it. There we go. Oh god, there's a witch and two endermen. And I just looked the endermans in their eyes. I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm too far. Oh my god, that's so many husks. What am I gonna do? Um, let's put the torches up here. I forgot to do that, even though I said I would. Oh god, they're coming. Oh no. Oh no. Um, are they too close? Shoot. Okay. I'll fight you. Uh oh, and a spider. Oh. Oh my god, just leave me alone. Where are there three more of you? Good lord, okay. Please let me go to sleep.
Um, okay, so I can make a couple more books and then make that lectern. Um, I already forgot the recipe. Is it like this? No? Well, I'm, first of all, I need a bookshelf. I don't know what I'm doing. I think that's a creeper right outside my house. I don't like that. How do I- ooh, don't throw things. I can't pick it up. Where is that little freak? I hate that. I can't even see him. Help? Oh, he's right there. Go away. No one likes you. Oh my god, he's gonna be right at my front door. I'm so freaking stupid, it's just four slabs. There we go. Ugh, okay. Now I gotta get back to the village. I have to dodge this guy. Frick, I don't know where he's at. Let's see him. I'm going up here. Hello? Oh my god, he's right there. Okay. I'm gonna lure him away from the house. Yeah. Get off my property. You are unwelcome. Okay. You know what, if I go back to where I stole that cleric's, um, you know, brewing stand, then I could put this lecture in there, and I could re-roll to see if I can get a librarian. I might have to block off the door, though, so he doesn't leave. Okay, is this the building? No, the other one. Here we go. Well, let's just put this here. You don't seem to be worthy. Or not worthy, but of use. How about you? What if I push you back into your village? Will you suddenly get in- Oh wait, you're a nitwit. You're useless altogether. Are... Hmm. Frustrating. There's too many barrels here. What if I strip them of their titles? Has any one of you become a librarian? No? Did they all become nitwits? Am I just dumb? I might have to kill some of the population off. But, there's an iron golem I have to worry about too. Hey you. Be- be my- be my librarian. Like, is nobody- <laughs> And what are you stuck in here for? Get out! How are- how is this happening? Are you- are you? No? Hell yeah, yeah. Okay, what if I just put this in closer proximity to somebody somewhere? Okay, so... I think that's a fisherman. Yeah. Hey you, be my librarian. Thank you. Um, Silk Touch is good. Oh man. Do I lock in this trade? For... Screw it. I'm gonna do it. Oh wait. I don't have leather. Crap, what am I doing? I used it to make the- Oh no. Where's that leather worker at? Oh wait, that was at the other village. I'm so stupid. All right, well, you know what? It's time to make a boat. Oh, wait, I made a shovel for nothing because I think on Bedrock Edition, you have to make that with the boat. <laughs> kind of dumb. Let me just toss it. Okay, um, the librarian is over here. Or, you know what? If I even, like, just destroy the lectern and take a villager, I don't care what villager, but a villager, then that'll be just, you know, piece of cake, right? So, I'll have to go to bed soon, because the sun's about to set. And then I'll just kidnap a villager. <laughs> Nothing like human trafficking. <laughs> oh, lord. Okay, it looks like the sun is setting. It's an optimal time to try to go to bed. You, let me, let me... There we go. Okay. Let the kidnapping commence. Who's the optimal victim? Ah! Whoever lives in this house. Wait, that's a nitwit over there. Are you a nitwit? No, you're not. Get in the boat. I said get into the boat! <laughs> you know what? I probably should have gone and... Hey, there's two people in here. What's going on? What if I go and push them in here? Sound like a plan? There you go. Alright. Let's set sail. In the water! Hell yeah. Let's break the bow. Neat. 
Is he attracted to my bed? I think. He's pathfinding. No, oh, don't tell me you're a leather worker now. Oh, you're lame. You just put the boat down. I might have to get rid of some of these blocks if he's going to switch professions like that. Okay, um, let's set up the lectern, like, over here in the corner. He's gonna be my roommate. Um, let's put you away, because you're also a job block. Let me go extract some fuel from a couple of these cauldrons and then put those away. Are you... You're still a leather worker, why? What was the reason? Hello? Okay, there you go. Um, let's push him. It's a little push. Now if I break this... Thank you. Um, I should probably shut him inside, right? There you go. A door that leads to nothing. Let's make another bed using all this string. Three and three. Yeah, let's have you sleep like just next to it for convenience. And where's the bell? All right, we have technically our first village. Neat. Okay, um, let's begin the re-rolling process. Hopefully that doesn't take too long. Oh! Oh, I did it! Okay, and I have just enough uh, to be able to, you know... Well, if I had another book... Shoot. Unless... Um, wait, uh, what else can I trade with you? I could trade paper. Locked in. Alright. You know what, I have this name tag. Let's give you, uh, some kind of alliteration-based name, because you're a mending villager. How about... Muriel. Alright. Muriel the Mending Villager. <laughs> Welcome to the party. Well, let's see. I will come back for you. Let's free you for now. And I'm gonna go see if I can trade with the leather worker out that way. I'll be back for you shortly. Oh, right. I forgot I blocked this off. That took a lot less time than the last series because, wow. I sat there for a long time, but this time it wasn't so bad. And I liked it actually. Hello, he's just going inside. Hi, uh... I don't want to buy all your shit. <laughs> Crap, okay, that's probably not the best course of action. I, I feel like I'm just really dumb. <laughs> Why did I trade with that guy? No one else has a job here? Like really? What about cartographer? Cartographer person. I could sell him paper. Hello. There you are. Yeah, I could sell him a bunch of paper. Okay. Got some more paper. At the very least, I could try to make some of those emeralds back. Um, oh, there he is. One emerald. Great. <laughs> Alright, I might have to just go home for a moment. <laughs> kind of sucks. Hey, what are you doing? It's frickin' time for you to go to sleep. What are you doing, you dummy? Oh my god. I have to capture her in the boat quickly before she dies. No. Not the portal. <laughs> Alright. I'm just gonna go to sleep. And hopefully nothing kills her. Why is she going back to the... Vi That's annoying, actually. Ah, oh, you Jezebel. Okay. Now you get your behind back inside. Yep, go, go in there. Yeah. God, villagers are a trip. Let's go sell most of this coal. Alright, I'll sell you some of this paper. Again, only one emerald. Alright, where is the smithy at? Oh, there you are. Okay. Good lord. I have to sell all my coal, and for what? <sighs> well, at least he's upgrading. Oh, iron. Hmm. Oh, well, at least I have enough money now, but I don't have a book still. This is a travesty. Yeah, 360. Some iron down there. That'll be kind of useful. Ooh. I'll gladly take this coal back. Since I just sold a lot of it. And then there's where I got the lava from before. Let's try to get back out of here. You know what, let's just kill a bunch of rabbits, actually, because 
Don't four of them create um, leather now? Oh, dropped a rabbit's foot, actually. Yeah, I think four of these will now be able to make a piece of leather. They're just hard to hit because they're so fast. Um, so yeah, here we go. And then... Neat, I have a book. I don't know why I didn't just do that sooner, honestly. I literally forgot about the rabbit hide thing until just then. Okay. Hello, I'd like to make a trade. Thank you much. Do I want to keep the fortune, or... Yeah, it, 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 it will probably be fine. Um, Let's continue trading this paper and stuff. It's so expensive. I really need a zombie converter thingy. Because that would be super helpful. Also, now that the sun's setting, I should really try to see if she'll sleep in the bed or not. Because she might still be attached to one of the beds back in the village that I stole her from. Also, I'm freaking lost. Like, I thought you could bone meal. Is that a bedrock only feature? That might be it. Yeah, she's not going to bed. She's still attached to the... <sighs> I might have to just wander over there and destroy all the beds in the village. Or at least the ones that aren't even occupied. I'll be back for you yet, Muriel. Because the village isn't terribly far from where we're living. I suppose it's still within the radius of which uh, she is still trying to get back to her bed. So, I hope you can defend these villagers well, Mr. Iron Golem. Destroy this. Oh no, that was yours. Okay. Um, that's occupied. Occupied. Uh, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna bother you. <laughs> okay, I should probably actually <laughs> kill these guys. Oh, 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 oh. No thanks. Oh god, there's so many of you. Ooh. Oh! Oh! 